Hello my fellow felines, this is Kitty Cat Plays of the Yarn here, and welcome to a speed build type video. If you haven't been on my channel uh, in a while, you may not know what this video is. I'm actually renovating some pre-made rooms here, and today I'm renovating two pre-made rooms from Eco Lifestyle, because if you've watched any of my more recent builds, you may know that I adore all the build items and everything but I needed to fix these because they were so plain and so bad. Like this one, it's just so light from the beginning, so I needed to fix it and to change it, and that's exactly what I'm doing in this video for both of these rooms. Uh, the first room I'm doing is like a sitting room type area. Uh, it could be considered a living room as well, but it doesn't have a TV, so that depends on your definition, I guess. And uh, the other room I'm going to do is the bedroom, and uh, it wasn't specified really if it was a kid's room or like just a spare room or anything, so I ended up turning it more into a kid's room, but uh, you'll see more of that when I actually get to that after I'm done with the sitting room. So I haven't done one of these videos since March, I checked, and the last one I did was Discover University. And I really just kind of forgot how much I enjoy doing these because I love having like the base there and a lot of the times when I do these I try to keep the same furniture, I try to keep the same vibe, but I just add more color or more clutter or just anything that I feel it needs to be like a good looking room and oftentimes I don't try to clutter it too much. I try to still attempt to make it look kind of like an EA room. Um, like maybe EA did this, maybe they didn't. Um, and that's the case with the living room. The bedroom, not so much, doesn't look like an EA room uh, in the end, but I really enjoy how both of them turned out, so I hope you guys do as well. And if you're curious as to what uh, either of the original rooms looked like before I messed with them, I am going to have some screenshots before and afters at the end of the video um, and yeah I'm just fiddling with some of the stuff that's already here right now um, because I don't like deleting things from builds when I do this uh, I do occasionally I delete a few things maybe um, but I like to try and keep everything um, so with this one I'm just changing swatches and like moving things and um, adding some stuff and uh, I layered rugs actually and I think it looks really cool. I used one from Laundry Day and I thought it looked really good. Um, this room, I really love how it turned out. It's a very um, mixed matched. I don't know. I really like how it turned out though. Um, and then as soon as we figure out the rug situation, we're going to be moving on to the next room oh wait no i never mind i lied um i wanted to take the thing on the wall off because i hate it um i was like it's too bulky and it looks ugly but i don't know what to do so i was just leaving it there i was like i don't know what to do so i'm just gonna leave it here i guess it's part of the original room whatever but in the end i do um i figure something out i don't remember what exactly i do but I change it out with something else from Eco Lifestyle. Oh, um, the these things. Though I noticed um, when I was taping screenshots that it actually does clip through the ceiling a tiny bit. So there's that to be aware of. But now we're on to the uh, bedroom. Obviously it's a kid's room um, with the dollhouse and the little, uh, oh gosh, what's it called? Activity table. Uh, this room actually ends up being really cute. I really enjoy it. Uh, I end up adding a chalkboard wall, which I saw someone do in a speed build. I don't remember who it was. It could have been any of the people I watch, and I watch so many. But um, I saw someone do it, and I was like, oh my god, yes. So I put a chalkboard wall in here. Um, and then I put that yellow accent wall because, uh, if you haven't noticed from this video and this video alone, I really enjoy accent walls. 
with this room i started out with like i was like okay the color scheme is going to be yellow and blue and that's it um but then i put these curtains in and everything just went off the rails this room ends up being like pretty colorful but not overwhelming i don't think if you think so let me know but um i don't think it's too overwhelming but i really like how it comes out it's a really cute kids room and uh I would have loved to have this as a child, but uh, alas, I had a tiny, basically, closet room. <laughs> um, not basically a closet, it was it was like the size of a walk-in closet. It was very small. My room was very small as a child. Um, well, for my entire life until I moved out, actually, because I grew up in that house. Um, but yeah, so here we are, I think about to make the chalkboard wall. Because I put up um, these like chalk looking decals and I was like, hmm, chalkboard wall. And uh, that, uh, what is it? Not wallpaper. I don't know what it technically is. But that from, um, it's from Eco Lifestyle and it looks great and it works perfectly for a chalkboard wall. I adore it. But now that I've talked about the build for a bit, I'm gonna go on a little ramble. Uh, so. I don't know if I've mentioned this here or not yet, but uh, I got a new job and I'm on like regular training now, uh, which is awesome, um, or regular work now. I was training for a while. I still actually have some like videos and stuff to do, but um, I'm on real training or real work now and it's awesome and um, the past like three days off I've had they've called me in to see if I can cover a shift and uh, it just really sucks because a lot of the time I can't get there in time because I have to walk to work a lot or I have to have someone bring me in and a lot of the time when they call and ask no one's home or no one's awake and uh, so it kind of sucks but um, I'm covering a shift tomorrow because she called me today and was like, oh, hey, could you cover this shift to this shift tomorrow? And I could go in half an hour later than she wanted me to. Um, so I took that and I'll get a little extra money and um, it'll be a good time, hopefully. Uh, I'm a little worried about it because I, I'm a cashier and I just got on register yesterday. Um, so I don't quite have all the bearings on it yet, but um, I've cashiered at many a places before, so I'm not super, super worried about it. Only a little teeny tiny bit. So I guess that's a good thing, right? I don't know why I went on that tangent. I guess I just think it's funny that um, the past like three out of four of my days off, they have called me and tried to get me to come in. Um, I don't know. <laughs> but uh, anyway, we are just gonna put a cute rug in the middle of this room and then we're going to get into some before and after screenshots, I believe, right? I think, yeah. Um, so before and after screenshots are here. And uh, with that, I am going to go, but I will see you all in the next video. Bye friends. If you like this one, be sure to leave a like, subscribe, and check out some other videos of mine while you're at it.